Hi guys, Bell Me Cherry here. Welcome. Come on in. Today I am starting out a little bit different. Happy Saturday. I am going to share with you guys a couple of goodies that I spotted. I am sharing with you guys a couple of goodies that I spotted at TJ Maxx and Marshalls. And I also um, made a stop at a Ross that was close by. Um, and I took the opportunity to, I mean, I just figured I would just share with you guys also what was there. Things were much cheaper. I noticed things were much cheaper at Ross. Um, but I just don't like how, you know, they have their whole makeup section set up. So I don't go to Ross often, but since I spotted a couple of goodies, I'll share that with you guys as well. So I hope you guys enjoy watching this um, run today, and um, I'll see you guys at the end to share with you guys what I found. Enjoy watching. <laughs> So here we are at TJ Maxx. I spotted this Dragon Beauty Lip Job Liner for $4.99. This is a lip liner. So here I'm seeing this Kevin O'Coin or Kevin O'Coin. The Molten Lip Color. This one is a matte molten color this one says molten gem maybe a shimmery lip color fire amber and nicole and they're going for 9.99 this may be a luxurious brand I'm not sure if this luxurious the packaging let's so i'm spotting the Pacific, the stila's stila eyeshadow liquid eyeshadows back here this one here is for $5.99. These are shimmer and matte. They have these here. I did grab me a couple of them early last year. And we're seeing this one. This is a mascara, waterproof mascara for $9.99. And this stay all day waterproof brow color for $5.99 and this is a medium brown all right guys I have hit the jackpot on the clearance section um, I'm at Marshall's right now and I found these lashes for one dollar these are the Cara Fabu lashes I have purchased a couple of them and I believe these are the ones that I normally use um, within my um, tutorial so I cannot pass on this these are normally $4.50 or $4.99 but they're going for $1 and I just found some in different um, style so yay all right guys I just rechecked the uh, clearance section finally found this um, root palette this is a blush palette for three dollars it has the yellow tag on there originally went for 5.99 so that's half price down so i think i'm getting it this time these are the shades yes and oh by the way i found my um jasmine body oil i've been looking for this and it's 5.99 all right guys we are here at ross i just spotted a couple of goodies i thought i'd share it with you guys seems to be that the stuff at ross are a lot cheaper than tj maxx and marshall's look here this one has been reduced to eight dollars and 49 cents this is the bare mineral mineral must have kit it has a couple of powders and a lippy on here that's a great deal what else we have? This Marc Jacob Omega Shadow Gel Powder Shadow is here for $5.99. This Zoeva Matte Palette Eyeshadow is here for $3.49. This is sickening. I'm take, definitely taking this one. 
this I would not find at that price at TJ Maxx or Marshall. We have this Pixie by Petra um, eye pencil, endless silky eye pen kit here for um, $8.99. This KVD um, shade light glam rock um, eyeshadow palette. These are the shades on here. And it's going for $6.99. This is a, a new um, product here, Wonder Beauty. Uh, on the glow, this is a blush and luminator for $9.99. This may be a stick. This, um, Shiseido uh, lip kit here. These are a couple of lipsticks on here for $35.99. It's yellow tack, that's $35.99. So this Bite Beauty powder we have seen over at TJ Maxx and Marshall. This here is $7.99. This Laura Geller or Seller, you're a natural. This palette is here for $6.99. Highest Lash Chronic Volume Mascara here from Pacifica. This is new. It's for $5.99. Pacifica, this highest definition death um, hemp fiber brow set. This one is for the brows, a tiny thing for $4.99. Look at this, you guys. The Friends X Revolution has this the one with all the Thanksgiving eyeshadow palettes, so it contains three shadow palettes of nine pan. These are the colors. Not sure if it's the Rachel, Zoe, or it doesn't say the name of each of the palettes, but these are the colors. This one is going for $6.99. I definitely need this in my life. This is a nice little set. I'm still spotting these Studio Fix foundations here from MAC. I'm looking for a deeper shade. This is the deepest that I've seen, but perhaps 50, NC50 would be my my shade. Hopefully I find it. And it's going for $14.99 here. From Bare Mineral, we're seeing this Combo Control Milky Face Primer here for $9.99. Too Faced, Born This Way, um, complexion powder in the color snow this is too light for $14.99 from NARS this light reflecting setting powder it's a loose powder and for $12.99 translucent crystal spotted some hip dot sponge pop palettes here for $7.99 each there's two different ones these are the colors in the back of the first ones. It looks like they're all shimmers. Yeah, pressed glitter. This one is. And this one has some pressed glitter and pigment on here. Looks pretty. Also spotting this C 3.5 Studio Fix Fluid SPF 15 from MAC. For $14.99. Tons of this bronzer from Bare Mineral for $10. Here for $11.99. There's a whole bunch of them back here. Starting to see some lippies here from Tarte. Shimmering lip paint uh, for $7.99. We have these lip treatments here. Ultra hydrating and nourishing lip treatment from Too Faced for $6.99. So, from Nail Cosmetics, we're seeing this 
watermelon brightening face mask for $9.99 this is pretty small so for milk we have this vegan milk cleanser Lenny Twyon vegan uh, for $9.99 I think this is a face cleanser yeah this is pretty new here from BH Studio we're seeing these brow dual brow pencil shade and define there's different colors here brunette blonde and i saw medium blonde here and they're going for 3.99 from nars we have this optimal brightening concentrate cream here for 24.99 seeing this camouflage um beauty uh, shadow palette here from stila from 9.99 and they have also have this matte and metal palette. This may seem like a nine pen palette for $14.99. And the um, skincare section, I spotted this. I am pure by the creme shop. This is a uh, beauty water, AKA toner. <laughs> it is a, oh, this would focus. You, it's a toner after cleansing or to prime makeup or to set makeup. So this is may, may be like a spray. Um, and it's going for $7.99. I also spotted this little Bird's Bee Daily Moisturizer Cream um, with cotton extract for $9.99 is new here sierra naturals vitamin c serum for 5.99 so here at marshall's i got i just found this Too face primer going for 14.99 this is cute and you from iHeart Revolution. This mini cheese palette here, going for six ninety nine. This this kind of caught my eye. It looks so pretty. Marble eyeshadow collection by Nicole Miller. I don't know. I'm not sure of their products. I have never used their products. This one's going for four ninety nine. I um, wonder if it's good or not. I don't know. Spotted this lip balm here. Lip balm set by e.l.f. This looks pretty new. I haven't seen this. Going for $3.99. So as you guys saw, there were a couple of things I spotted. I did grab me a couple of goodies today. Um, I'll share with you guys what I got. To start, um, well, the very last one that I did get is this palette from Marshalls, the Friends X Revolution palette, um, the one with all the Thanksgiving. These are the palettes right here. Nine pen palette. I mean, it was a good deal, so I didn't want to pass out on it. I have been eyeing the Friends palette, the Nine Pen Friends palette, the, the the characters of Friends, but each of them were like close to the price of all these three together, like four or five dollars, if I'm not mistaken. So all these three um came out to seven dollars. So. This is a better deal than um, the other one. So I'm sure the formula is the same. I will definitely keep this little collection closed to give them a shot, to try them out, and hopefully I like them. It's not much of a punch to it. You know what? Let me not, let me, not, let me just not. Hopefully they're good. Like I don't like this first swatch that just happened here it looks a lot brighter on camera than in person my finger barely has um 
shadows on it. Um, anywho, the next thing that I did get was from Zoe. I'm not sure how far this palette is um, goes back. The Zoeva palette, I did not want to pass out on these matte, and, you know, warm matte shades. This palette was like $3.49, you guys. So, I don't care how old the palette is. As long as these colors deliver, I got my, I got, you know, what I'm looking for. These are the colors. I already played swatch these two because this these were what kind of caught my eye and they look very pigmented i swatched them on the back of my hands already so they were super 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 nice try not to dirty my white pants this is them the second one i need to kind of build it up but once it's there, it's there. It stayed on pretty, you know, it stayed put. So with some good primer and everything, we'll probably make the best of it. So that was that. Along with, um, so also from Ross, also from Ross, I spotted the Bite Beauty um, powder, um, pressed powder. This one, I'm just, I may just return it. This is a medium too. I thought from TJ Maxx and Marshalls, I mainly saw deep one there, which were much lighter. So I know I noticed the number two and I forgot about the deep part of it. I went and grabbed it, but coming home, this palette is not for me, not even for my under eye. So I can't really use this. I have to return this. Um, hopefully I get store credit or get some other color. I don't know if I have the receipt still. Shit. And this was $7.99 from Ross. Now going back to Marshalls, I went to the clearance section. I spotted the Rude undaunted palette blush palette i've been eyeing this palette from the start finally got really you know to the yellow tag rate um which is half price than what it normally goes for this is these are the shades i've been eyeing them although i do have other root palette now um this is no longer on that, like my top 10, I mean top palette of Rude because I do like the other ones, the ones that I got from last time, the Candy Crush or Blush Crush palette, I do like those palette. But I since the price was much lower than it was originally, I got this one. It was not swatch or anything, so um, I'm not mad at it. I'll also give that a try. Um, what's next? I, from that same clearance section, I spotted me tons and tons of Cara Beauty lashes. I have been using Cara Beauty lashes. The, these are different kinds that I have not tried before, but I do recall, let me see. I think I have one here that I have not opened yet yep so this is the number five that i bought from however long ago number five the price is originally four dollars 3.99 so this one is a5 and i did grab me a couple of different ones there's different styles on here different you know form and shape or um thickness of the lashes i got all of them okay i did not leave not one behind this one looks pretty nice i do like my lashes to be you know shorter in the inner part to fan out like you know a cat eye so i i listen one dollar i cannot beat it i have lashes for years now <laughs> for the whole year 
I am not gonna, and I also reuse them, and I have a whole bunch that I that I'm already reusing, and yeah, that was a great deal, and I, I I've had this sitting in here, I have not opened yet, so adding that to the bunch. Um, that's pretty much it. I hopefully you guys do spot a couple of things you guys may want as well. I'm definitely thankful about this, but I'm not sure on how these um palette will you know perform. Uh so hopefully it's a good it's it's hopefully they deliver. Um so anyway, that's basically it, you guys. I hope you guys enjoy watching today's video. Um, don't forget, before you leave, do subscribe, like, comment. Let me know what you guys think. And I will see you guys on the next one. Bye-bye.